Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're going to learn about multi-step equations, and we're going to solve each equation. So, if I was given this equation, 24a minus 22 equals negative 4 times 1 minus 6a. Well, first thing, I'm going to distribute that negative 4. So, negative 4 times 1 is negative 1, uh, negative 4. <laughs> nice, Sean. And then we have a minus 6a, well, plus is negative, right? So plus uh, negative 4 times a negative 6a is a positive 24a. Fantastic. Bring down here 24a minus 22. Okay? Well, what I'm going to do now is just combine my like terms here. So I'm going to subtract a 24a, bring it over to the left, and I'm going to add a 22 to the right. On the left, well, 24a... Well, minus 24a is just 0. Okay, they canceled out. I have negative 4 plus 22 is a positive 18. Well, 0 does not equal 18, right? They're not equal. When that happens, when you have something that's not equal, a number not equaling another number, we have no solution. So no solution going on here. And that's my final answer. No solution. There was no number that worked that made this equation true. So let's recap. I distributed a negative 4 across. Negative 4 times 1 is negative 4. And the minus 6a is plus a negative. So negative 4 times negative 6a is a positive 24a. Two negatives multiplied is a positive. I then brought all my le uh, number, uh, letters to the left, numbers to the right. Uh, negative 24a, I sub or subtracted 24a to both sides. That canceled, gave me a 0. I added 22 to both sides, giving me a positive 18 on the right. Negative 4 plus 22 is a positive 18. Well, 0 does not equal 18, right? So it's not equal. When that happens, when I have a number not equaling another, another number, it's not the true statement, I then will write no solution, okay? Because there's no solution that works. So my final answer here for this problem is no solution.